line and angles this is the new chapter now we read first line what is line the straight path between two points a and b is called a line segment ab just suppose a and b are the point when we meet these two point to each other by a straight path is it is called a line second is collinear point collinear point is three and more than three points are said to be collinear if there is a line if there is a line which contain them all jab just suppose a b c are the three points a b and c when we meet them all point by a straight line these point are called the collinear point these are a b c when two line across to each other at a point are called the intersecting line just suppose a line a b and a line b c two cross each other at a point to c o this is ab and this is cd across to each other at a point o so these lines are called intersecting line now we read about the parallel line two line this is two t w o two two line a and b are called parallel line if they have no common point and never intersecting to each other it is show here of one line a and another line b these two line so these are the two parallel line because they have no common point and never intersecting to each other now we read about the angle two lines oa and ob having a common point o form angle aob uh, array oa and ob these two line having a common point o and make an angle it is called angle a o b now we read about the interior angle what is the interior angle an angle which is inside of a triangle is called a interior angle uh, this is an interior angle of a triangle and exterior angle an angle which is outside of a triangle is called the exterior angle exterior angle is um, this is a triangle and uh, the outside angle Mm, this one 
it is called the exterior angle an angle of 360 degree it has rotated through a 360 degree from a line is called the complete circle and complete angle uh, we can say here is an this is a line and uh, an angle this is an angle of 360 degree